What up, it is Sam here, and I am uh, about to go to bed, and I wanted to talk about TikTok, and I talk about a moonshot in terms of how they could develop their platform to be something that is a combination of both social network and YouTube all wrapped into one. And I had to make a quick video around that. So if this is your first time here, what's good? My name is Sam. And for those of you who are returning, two things. You had better be pressing that thumbs up button and it's going to freaking see you. Now, let's get into it. Okay, so TikTok is a is like a social network. It's kind of like Vine combined with like Instagram. You can only do video and it's basically anything from like two seconds to two up uh, to one minute but you can put like a collage of pictures together and stuff and you can like kind of battle with each other in a way um so they have some interesting ways to share right because you can kind of like duel against somebody so that's very unique but it's the only platform that is audio centric meaning they're all video and you, you either do original audio on your thing or, or you put music or you take somebody else's audio and you use it on yours. Or just there's a, a catalog of, of music on the platform. And, and so what I've noticed is that people are finding music on TikTok and looking for it elsewhere. And this gave me the idea that what if TikTok actually embraced the music like ethos of TikTok to give artists an incentive to put music on there where which something like the YouTube partnership and they expanded the 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 time that they allow videos on there and this would allow you have a giant audience there already and who are watching like and I don't know what the number was but like a billion plus views a day of content so allow that time to go from the you know two seconds to 60 seconds to multiple minutes and incentivize artists to put their music on there because then they can their music can expand and allow them to get like a percentage of the ad revenue um that was coming in associated with that and then you can combine what's happening over on youtube right the second biggest site on the planet with like place like facebook where there's a shitload of people right and that's where they're spending their time because they'll go interact with people so uh this could be super interesting i'd like to know what your thoughts are down below in the comment section use hashtag stolt and then uh at the end of the videos uh, a lot of times not tonight but i will actually go through and do a q a and talk about your comments so if you'd like to see that at the end of a video after i do it at the end of the video i will likely leave a comment um as long as i don't forget to leave a comment and tell you which video it's in so you can go check it out if you're interested. Peace.